For Doppler and M modes, the first thing you'll want to do typically is press the MD cursor. Make sure you're in a live image so you can scroll it around. And here, you can move it to wherever you'd like to move the cursor before you get into Doppler mode. This allows you to see a better 2D image. Before you do that, you can also use your angle correct. And notice your angle is shown right here. And quick angle, adjust it quickly by 60 degrees. So to enter M mode, we just simply hit M. And we have our M line right there. Again, down along the bottom, we have all the various parameters that you can change. And by clicking to the right here, you'll see there's an additional set of parameters for adjusting that image. I'll go back to B mode. Hit my MD cursor, get my angle, then I'll go into pulse wave Doppler. Now I have the auto calculation set, and you can see that it's following along there. As I show in a measurements video, you can make changes to where that, whether you have the auto calcs on or not. Up here, we can choose what auto calcs we want to show up on the screen right now. I've only got pulse peak systolic.